Hi, here are our 813 notes. Um, it says factor each quadratic expression below with possible use a diamond problem and generic rectangle for each one. So the problem is x squared plus 6x plus 9. So I drew my generic rectangle. Remember, you know that the x squared is going to go here and the 9 will go there. Once you get that information, then you can start your diamond problem. You need things that will multiply to be 9x squared, because remember your diagonals will multiply to be the same thing. So you need the, your these two to multiply to be 9x squared and add to be 6x. So that would be 3x and 3x. So you know that those are going to be the two that go in the other diagonal. From there, x times x is x squared. So then x times what would give you 3x? Well, 3. Same thing up here. And then here you can check and make sure 3 times 3 is 9. So you have x plus 3 times x plus 3. B, you, on this one, when you draw your generic rectangle, you put your 2x squared here and your 3 goes there. Now, to figure out what these are, remember you want to multiply to be 6x squared and add to be 5x. Well, what two things multiply to be 6x squared that add to be 5x? 2x and 3x. So those are going to be what has to go here. Now, when you decide, because when you look here, one of them's going to have to be a 2x and one's going to have to be an x. So thinking about where you could put that 2, you would have to put it to where it will be, where it can match with this 2x. Because if you put it here, there's not 2 times any whole number that would get you 3. So you would have, you would know that the 2x is going to have to be on this side, so it can match up with that one, which puts the x here. 2x times what would give you 2x? 1. x times what would give you 3x? Three, 3. And then you can double check. 3 times 1 is 3. So you get 2x plus 3 times x plus 1.